Welcome back to the Orbital Insights. And today we are talking about one of the most intriguing and mind-bending theories in modern cosmology. The Multiverse Theory. Before we start, I ask you all to kindly hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. You guys are the reasons why I make these videos and your support helps grow the channel. The Big Bang Theory tells us that our universe began as a singularity. An infinitely dense and hot point, around 13.8 billion years ago. And has been expanding ever since. But what if the Big Bang wasn't a one-time event? What if it's an ongoing process that creates an infinite number of universes? This is the idea behind the multiverse theory. Which suggests that our observable universe is just one of an infinite number of parallel universes. Each with its own set of physical laws and properties. This theory raises many questions and challenges our current understanding of the universe. One popular version of the multiverse theory is the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics which suggests that every time a quantum event occurs, the universe splits into multiple parallel universes. This implies that there are an infinite number of parallel universes, each with a different outcome of every quantum event. This theory could help to explain the mysterious nature of quantum mechanics and the concept of superposition. Another version of the multiverse theory is the inflationary multiverse, which proposes that our universe is just one of an infinite number of universes that formed from the inflationary expansion of a primordial patch of space-time. Inflationary multiverse theory was proposed to solve some of the major problems. With the Big Bang theory, such as the horizon problem and the flatness problem. This suggests that there are an infinite number of other universes that are similar to our own, but have different properties and characteristics. The multiverse theory raises the possibility that there are universes with different forms of matter and energy, and even universes in which the laws of physics are fundamentally different from our own. This could mean that there could be a universe where the gravitational constant is different, or a universe where the speed of light is faster or slower than in our universe, which could result in different forms of matter and energy. This could also imply that there could be universes where the fundamental constants of nature are different and the standard model of particle physics could be different. The multiverse theory also has implications for the anthropic principle, which states that the universe must have the properties it does because if it were any different, life as we know it would not be possible. The multiverse theory suggests that there are an infinite number of universes, each with its own set of physical laws and properties, which means that the anthropic principle must be expanded to take into account the possibility of life existing in other universes. This could imply that the existence of life is not as rare as we thought, and the universe is not fine-tuned for the existence of life as we know it. It also raises the question of whether there could be other forms of life in other universes, and if so, what they might look like. The multiverse theory also raises the possibility of communication or travel between parallel universes. This could be possible through the use of wormholes, which are shortcuts through space-time that could connect different universes. However, the feasibility of this idea is still under debate and it's not clear if wormholes are stable enough to be used as a means of travel. The possibility of communication or travel between parallel universes also has implications for the search for extraterrestrial life. If other universes exist, it could mean that there are other forms of intelligent life in the cosmos. And we may not be alone in the universe after all. Another theory that is closely related to the multiverse theory is the holographic principle theory. This theory suggests that the information in a region of space can be encoded on its boundary, potentially offering a new perspective on the nature of reality. This theory could have implications for our understanding of the nature of space and time and could potentially provide a new perspective on the relationship between space, time, and matter. It could also have implications for the multiverse theory, as it could suggest that the information in a universe is encoded on its boundary, and that multiple universes could exist within a larger universe. Another important concept that is closely related to the multiverse theory is the existence of dark matter and dark energy. These mysterious forms of matter and energy make up the majority of the universe's mass energy budget, yet they have yet to be directly observed. Some theories propose that dark matter and dark energy could be evidence of the existence of other parallel universes. The multiverse theory is still a topic of ongoing research and debate in the scientific community. Current and future research on the multiverse theory includes using observational data from telescopes and satellites to search for evidence of other universes, and using theoretical models and computer simulations to explore the properties of different multiverse models. While the multiverse theory is still a topic of ongoing research and debate in the scientific community, it offers a tantalizing glimpse into the infinite possibilities of the cosmos. We hope this video has provided you with an in-depth look into the multiverse theory and the many questions. Let us know your thoughts on the multiverse. Do you think there is another, you, in another universe? Leave a comment below. Until next time, stay curious.